Rush Towing Systems in Dallas has a real treat for you today. We just built up one of our premier rollbacks, this beautiful Viper Red 2012 Peterbilt 337 with an 8.7 liter 300 horsepower PX8 diesel engine, aluminum fuel tank, uh, def tank with a chrome uh, face on it, aluminum wheels, low pro 22.5 tires, 22 foot, 7.5 ton, 102 inch wide bed. That's 15,000 pounds of carrying capacity with removable rails, 10,000 pound winch, uh, stationary headache rack with a chain rack in there that locks, LED light bar, work lights on the winch, LED lights on the body, lots of key slots on this body so they have lots of good tie down points. Really nice load angle with this 22 foot bed. Uh, you can adjust that, you have a higher dump angle if you'd like. Now you can't see it on here because the bed's back, but it has a 4,000 pound wheel lift uh, with L-arms. Uh, that's a really nice wheel lift on this truck. Gives you a lot of strength, a lot of ability to tow some of those heavier pickup trucks and SUVs on the wheel lift. Um, it does have a air dump valve, which I did not dump it out. You can actually get lower than this load angle right here. Uh, you can dump that air right from the dash. It's a hot shift push button PTO. Most trucks of this size have an air shift PTO, but since it has that Allison automatic transmission, we decided we'd go with a clutch shift, hot shift PTO. Um, the lockdown system on this, <coughs> excuse me, lockdown system on this seven and a half ton, really beefy. Uh, it's gonna be really hard to tear that one up because you got these extra braces down here on both sides. Uh, and we're not using, we're not using thin metal on this and tying in the toolboxes like we used to. That brace is there to keep everything down. Just like all Jordans, this bed is going to be greaseless. You do not have to grease it. The only grease points on it are going to be the cam locks uh, that lock down your L-arms. So uh, that should make it easier for maintenance. Now this chassis, I mean, we got the side windows. We've got the window extension in the back. Um, on the other side, so, you know, it's got the Peterbilt chrome grill that you can sit there and bang on, it's not a decoration, it really is functional. Chrome bumper, uh, you know, you got your your window in the passenger door there to help you uh, help you keep those blind spots out. Just like all Peterbilt's, it's got those flat glass panels there that are about 80 bucks a piece. So if you ever have to, if you ever catch a rock or something, it's not a $600 crazy expensive windshield. Um, this is the newly remodeled interior. A little more ergonomic than before. Uh, you're going to notice your window controls are right there on the door, along with, as well as the mirror controls. AM, FM, CD player. Uh, this one's got that air dump valve I told you about. Uh, PTO control. Um, it's got the push button transmission. Just push it, drive, neutral, uh, reverse, and you can you know control your gears manually if you want to. Uh, we've got the switch panel built into the dash. Give it a nice clean finish. Cruise control, exhaust brake, uh, it's got a big air horn. Um, it's got those chrome mirrors, uh, and it's got uh, a chrome visor, chrome bumper, aluminum wheels. It really did put a lot of nice options on this truck. And this truck will get up and go. Uh, if you want, you can get this truck going 75, 80 miles an hour. It will go down the road for you. So there she is. Call Hunter Smith if you got any further questions. Uh, 214. 228-4487. Truck's located in Dallas, Texas. <coughs> if you don't like red, heck, we'll build this truck for you in any color you like. But uh, that really is, really is one nice rollback. Take a look, Hunter Smith, 214-228-4487. Or look us up on rushtow.net.